Hey folks, I'm Corin Spice Freak Sloss, here again with my buddy x -Ban. Hey all. And today, we're going to be trying some freeze-dried durian. Now, for those who don't know, durian is also known as the king of fruits, because it's apparently absolutely delicious, but also the vomit fruit, because its stench is off the charts. And it has been known to just make people throw up the moment the fruit is cut into. I have no idea how much is going to come through in the smell of the freeze-dried stuff, but it's quite possible that there will be a severe reaction to this, so I brought the vomit bucket in case. In addition to that, we also have some flavoured water from Oasis to take the taste away. No, there is no actual taste to this water, which is quite weird. It's just flavour. So there's no sweetness, there's no saltiness, there's no bitterness, there's no umami savouriness and did I say sourness? No. Okay. There's none of that. It's just sort of a weird aroma of red berry and tiny hint of pepper. Spicy raspberry they call it. They say that. We'll see how it goes. Mm. But anyway, before we try this, Hugh like to ask. Yep, this smells an awful lot and it's probably gonna leave a lingering smell on you. You don't have any plans with your girlfriend anytime soon, do you? No. I'm not, I don't currently have a girlfriend. Oh! You've broken up! Yes, sadly. Well, in which case, I've been meaning to say this for a while, but Hugh... that is right now? Blue or dark turquoise, I'd say. I think that's leaning towards the turquoise, actually. Yeah, it's leaning towards the So turquoise, turquoise, according to my list, is either you are content or you're in love. I would say the content one. Fair enough. <laughs> <laughs> sorry, so, to, sorry to break your, break your heart, but no. <laughs> so, no, this list is one that I compiled from various different lists online. You will see what that I'll upload it with this video, you'll get a good look at what I've compiled, but basically it's about as bogus as any other mood ring list. It doesn't actually measure your mood, all it does is measure fluctuations in body temperature, which may happen as a response to your mood, but won't indicate a specific mood. Okay. So, the reason we're wearing that today is because durian is referred to as heaty. It's known for raising your body temperature, potentially if you have enough, to lethal heat stroke levels. Though whether that's actually true or not is unknown. What has come out in studies, which is quite weird, is if you have this with paracetamol, then it has been shown to lower your body temperature quite dramatically. Hmm. Yeah. So hopefully you're not taking any of that. No, I'm not taking any, med any med medicine Good. of any kind of but aside from that, studies have been fairly inconclusive. So let's crack this open and see what it's like. Oh, do you want to read this first? All right. It's Be Cherry brand freeze dried durian. Be Cherry. Oh, Be Cherry, sorry. <laughs> Product of China, best before the 1st of the 3rd, 2019. Hopefully, this video goes up before then. Imported by Oriental Delight. For allergens, see ingredients in bold. Ingredients, durian. 100% durian. It's kind of what we expected, isn't it? Mm. From what is what, what is. If it wasn't 100% durian, durian, I'd be quite disappointed. Yeah. Anyway, let's crack this open. Durian extract. Potato. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that would be good in a stupid sort of way. I'm smelling something already. Oh, that doesn't smell that great. No. It sort of smells musty, it sort of smells melon-like. Mm. It isn't a good melon. But no, it's like old, unpleasant melon. That smells... Oh, what is that? It's like... It's almost like corn. Yeah, almost. It's definitely toasted smelling. Toasted, rotting corn, I reckon. Yeah. Note, I do have some of that on order at the moment. Wow. So we'll see what that's like when it turns up. Appetising. So, you want to try oh. a bit? Alright. And yeah, your drink is there if you need something to wash the taste away. 
if it does turn out to be as bad as it smells. Texture of that is not good, but actually it's not that bad. It initially feels a little powdery and then it turns into basically popcorn. Case is not too far from popcorn either. It's like initially a bit melony, but mm. it hangs about. It's got sort of melon hints that come and go throughout, but the main thing is it's something toasted and it is sort of kind of popcorn-like or like. I don't think it's a pleasant taste, though. I don't. It's not one I'm a big fan of. You don't want any more then? I'll have one. It's not awful. It's not awful by any means. I think but the, I think the it's not great dimension. and actually I've suddenly got a weird aftertaste to it that I don't like. Yeah, it's not a nice aftertaste. But I will know yeah. that this is freeze-dried, so it's likely that a fresh example of durian will have a stronger smell to it. Yeah. It didn't when I had it with the Yorkshire Food and Drink okay. Festival. But at the same time, we feel like the durian we had for that was probably overripe. It didn't smell of much, it didn't taste of much, it was just kind of nothing. Mm. There's a hard bit to this one. This has more scent and more flavour. It probably, if it was actually properly ripe and fresh, it would have even more still. And I'm going to dump this in the bucket and I'm going to have a drink. You're making me feel... Because the flavour is getting worse and worse in my mouth. If I will know anything, it is making me feel a bit hot. Okay. Is your ring changing? Yes, it is. It is going Ooh. purple. Oh, what does purple mean? Yeah, so, it's totally purple. Yeah. Purple is driven, claritous, as in sort of full of clarity, mm. or elated. But no, I'm definitely going to crack my drink open. Cause I'm going to have this one last bite. That oh. durian. Oh. Yeah, that isn't a good taste. No. Ooh, that's the inside of that. That looks like actual fruit now. It's not the freeze-dried yeah. stuff so much. Yeah. Oh. That's a nice relief. In the middle it gets close to it's pretty much dried fruit. Oh. I'm going to have to try that then. we got a nice big bit that I can crack open to get some But it is not pleasant. It oh, I'm not expecting to like it. Inside bit doesn't smell like much, but there's a little bit in there that you can see of mm. actual fruit. Oh wow, that has a real sweetness to it. Almost honey-like. And then the flavour of... Yeah, the purple ooh, subsiding ooh. slightly. That has the tiniest, tiniest hint of, not exactly spicy, but... Sort of aromat-like garlic. Or a onion, or something like that. I'm noting that my ring is going slowly back to turquoise as its right. purple colour subsides. So we can't say for certain that your change in body temperature was related to the fruit or just related to you going, ah, I don't like this, mm. but... When I ate it, mm. I did feel a heat, a very, very light heat inside. I've tried mood rings in chilli before mm. and there is no change. The fact that this does something it's actually quite surprising. It's going turquoise now. Right, so you're returning to normal now that the durian's yeah. in your mouth. So that implies that it's not the digestion of it. It's raising your body temperature, mm. if anything. I wonder if just eating garlic would affect the mood ring. Maybe. But it's a mood ring, it's a gimmick. Well, it measures a real thing. Mm. Somewhat. Not the thing that it says it measures, but it measures a real thing. But yeah, I'm not going to eat any more of that. The actual fresh bit of fruit inside was quite nice, I thought, but the surrounding dried fruit was just gross. I thought that the fresh fruit bit had a much more accentuated flavour, but I didn't like that flavour. I thought it was quite pleasant and honey, personally. I'm not a big fan of honey, so that may be okay. partially why. Do you think it would make a good hot sauce, though? If you mix it in, I think it could work. Because I feel like if... If the fresh stuff really does smell as bad as people say, then it would be quite fun to have sort of a fairly mild to medium green chilli sauce that tasted and smelt of durian, mm. and therefore was a challenge in a different sort of way. Anyway, so, let's see exactly how bad this is. I've been told that if you splash this over your face, you really feel something from it. I've got nothing from drinking it, so let's find out. 
Yeah, still nothing. And now I'm just wet in the crotch. I'm just hitting myself in the face with this. <laughs> yeah, I don't, yeah. I, don't I don't want to just tip it up and pour it over my head, because then I'll get it on my suit. Oh, I've actually already got it on my suit. Never mind. I didn't feel anything from it. The, the flavour is... Yeah. As much, it, it just feels like it tastes like a weak squash. To me. Yeah. Oh, well, it has the flavour of a weak squash without the taste, without the sweet taste yeah. of a weak squash. It's weird in that you're getting the berries without any of the sweetness of the oh berries. Oh, there's the durian stuck at my tea. Oh. Well, I guess we'll leave it there, then. Mm. Bye. Bye, kids.